Hi everybody, welcome to Hook and Stitch and Island Style. I'm Antoinette, your hostess, coming to you from Deer Island, New Brunswick, Canada, located in the Bay of Fundy. I want to re welcome all returning Fiber Family members, new Fiber Family members, and if you like yarn, mosaic crochet, knitting, and all kind of other things, tutorials, what have you, then click the subscribe, the bell, and all, and hopefully YouTube will notify you when I do any of the aforementioned. Um, yes, I'm in the same. This is video two, um, and it's probably four hours later. I have packed up. This is about the mystery boxes. I have packed up all of those. Okay. I'm going to show you some of them. Now, I said they were going to be $25 a box. Um, what I was thinking, if somebody wants more than one box, I can combine them. In, now, if you live in Canada, I can combine probably three boxes into one of our um, this is our medium flat rate box and $30 for shipping. Okay? And I can stuff a lot of yarn. This is the medium. The large is a little bit bigger and I think the shipping is $34. If you live in Canada and you want to buy multiple mystery boxes, I can, I will take those three mystery boxes and put them in, in, you know, two or three or four, whatever I can squeeze into one of those boxes and you only have shipping. One, 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 one shipping charge. Now, if you live in outside in the United States um, I can still combine them and you'll still only have one shipping cost um, before you you know say you want the boxes I can give you an approximate shipping price um, and then you can decide whether you think it's worth it or not now I have some boxes I did the yarn is caked up because either the skein was all catawampus so I sat one day and I caked up a whole bunch of yarn. Now I'm going to show you these boxes. I think there are... 15, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. There are, there are 15 boxes. I think I have 5 boxes left out of the pack I bought. So I'm going to show you the yarn. Again, you won't know what box you're getting. Okay, and they're a mixture of acrylic. Most of it's acrylic. If it has wool, it's just a very minor bit. If you are sensitive to wool, just let me know, and I will double check the box before I ship it, okay? Now, there are some boxes that are a little bit less because they might have been yarn I caked up because I might have used a couple of pieces, or I had a bunch of cakes I did, and I put them into one box. It'd be great for amigurumi, or if you're doing, you like to do granny squares, stuff like that. But I managed to empty four totes. And I am going to have another shot my stash sale, but it's not going to be till the new year because I've got so much going on between now and I'm going to be gone the pretty much the entire month of December. So, you know, bear with me. I'm trying. Uh, work schedule. When I get laid off, then <laughs> we can do more. Okay. So let's let's get to it. I'm going. I don't know if I'll show you all of them, but I'm going to show you some of them. And. Some of these boxes are really squished down. Um, and a lot of these have, a, there's a lot of bling in these boxes. There's one of the boxes. Okay. There's six skeins in this one. This is what was one of them. There are... There's seven skeins in this one. Now this one does contain wool. They're 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 blends. Oh, yeah, I really had it. these boxes have to be taped good. And next box. Now this one is all cotton, and there's one ball of the Nako mohair special. Okay, that's cotton. And then I stuck this in to fill the box out. Let's see if I can kind of smush this in here. We're going to, I'm just repacking this box here. 
there. And this has got two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's got six or seven skeins. Six or seven skeins in it. You can see. That's another one. I think that's the only one that's cotton. So there's only one cotton box. And it does have that one. It's got a little bit of mohair in it. This one is one of the really squished boxes. Oh. Yeah, it's this will be this will have to be taped. Again, bling and there's that one there. That one's got six skeins in it. Sometimes it's hard to get these boxes to close. They're really going to... Well, you know me. I tape anyways. Yeah, they'll be... We'll have to tape them up. And there's this one. This one's got one, two, three, five. I'm going to post on the community tab. And I'll post a link prob in, probably in the Yaya's. But most everybody's in the Yaya's is a family member, ch channel member, family member. Okay, this one here is one of those boxes I told you. I caked up because the, the cake was a mess. This here. And then I had a couple of... I just needed for fillers. I could put them in... So, I mean, this one here is a is a fine... This is a whole donut caked up. And it is a cotton bamboo blend. And this is just a little... Just to fill out the box. These boxes are going to be $20, okay? $20 plus shipping. Again, if you want more than one, I will be willing to combine them so there's only one shipping charge. And I would say only for the U.S. and Canada. I'm, I'm thinking that um, across the pond, it's, it's going to be not worth your while. I mean, it's up to you if you want to, if you want to pay the money, but the shipping, I mean, I can go, you can send a, send a ground, but it could take up to... A month to get there um, but the shipping is a lot cheaper um, so we'll see I mean, it's up to you it's your call like I said I'm just trying to, to, to de-stash them as Sean I managed to empty four of my my, my uh, smaller totes in the bedroom closet here's another one okay now this one isn't caked up it's all balled up but that is several skeins of uh, Patton's lace or Patton's lace with sequins. This has got bling in it, and then three soft yellows and a white. Weights are mixed, all different weights. But I tried to have some kind of at least a color, cohesive color coordination for most of them. I don't like turning my back on you, so bear with me. I'm just going to pause it here. Okay, I just had to move some boxes. Now, I'm showing you all the boxes. You can go back and look through. You're not going to know what you're going to get, but it's giving you an idea of what I put into the mystery boxes. This one here is a whole bunch of caked up yarn. Every box, there's enough to make projects out of. And I just was going through the totes in my bedroom. I haven't even gone through the yarn in the craft room. That's another day. So you can see I, I tried to keep, you know, I tried to make it, it pretty, as it, it's cohesive as I could for color, you know. Like I said, there's 15 boxes. It's $20 a box. I will combine them, if you live in Canada, into either the medium or the large flat rate shipping. So you only pay one shipping. 
Now this one here really is squished, okay? Because there's two of these in there. And that is Lime Brand's Thick and Quick Metallic Facet Eco Calm Stripes. I, I loops and threads, but so so you can see it's it's quite a variety of yarn. And again, I try to keep it somewhat color cohesive. That one there, that you know, they're all bright colors. Another squished box. This has got six skeins in. This is a bright box. <laughs> Put your sunglasses on. Some charisma and two neon pink. Um, back before it was changed to Loops and Threads Soft Classic, it uh, was the uh, Craft Smart Neon. I did my pick and mix cow out of that. This really is going to have to be taped because it's really squishing down. There's six skeins in this one. Only, only four more to go. This one here. This is a lot of bling. <laughs> There's another one of these under. Okay. So you can see. So you can get an idea. Again, most of you know what this stuff costs. So, 20 bucks a box plus shipping. I think is more than fair. Another one like that. I think the minimum skeins is five. There's at least five. This one has two more under it. And that is a donut. This was kind of a real mixture of fibers and, and weights. Okay, we're down to the last one. Last one. Now this box does contain a small amount of wool. This is what's in there. There is 11 skeins in this one. So, like I said, 20 bucks a box. That's 20 Canadian. If you want more than one box of yarn, U.S. and Canada, across the pond, it's up to you. Email me. We'll talk about it. Um, you know, I can let you know the shipping fee. Uh, there's 15 boxes. First come, first serve. Um, Canada, I will combine the boxes. I think I can get up to three boxes into the large um, flat rate shipping box. And I can get two boxes into the medium flat rate shipping box. The, the, the medium is like $30. And the large is like 35 So it's up to you. Um, shipping for the U.S., I can give you, you know, you send, tell me what you want. And again, I can combine them into one package and make it one shipping cost for multiple boxes. Like you would pay, say you want two boxes, then it would be $40 plus shipping. Instead of shipping for each individual box, I'll combine them into one, one package. And I always try to find the best rate. You know, I'll t you know, sometimes I don't send a track. I'll send what's called small packet air, and it, it, that that's delivered in six to ten days. Um, there's not tracking on it, but I have had, and I have shipped a lot of packages. I have had one package lost in five years, one, and it went to the states. So, the email, email me. It is in the description box below. Um, if you want one box. Um, with your shipping address, and I will check before I take any, and it's going to be by PayPal. If you live in Canada, I can do e-transfer. Um, 
and once these 15 are gone they're gone um i will like i said i do have more yarn and this is an ongoing d stash um i just try to do it when i have time uh, you guys know my work schedule is crazy a lot of hours i'm now trying to find somebody that will switch with me wednesday's my first day back for my five but barb's gonna be gone until six o'clock or better we can't leave the girls the, the girls in their kennels for 12 plus hours that's just not fair so i'm trying to find somebody to switch with me that one day it's probably gonna be me working six days straight but they're my they're my fur babies so you know got to figure out something so that's the mystery boxes they're mystery boxes because you've seen what's in the boxes it gives you an idea what kind of yarn it is but you won't know what you're getting i'm just gonna pick a box they're back there you know i said and like i said if it's uh a, a matter of you wanting more than one box we can combine them into like i take them out of those boxes and put them into a flat rate shipping box for canada or a another box for uh, the u.s now i had ordered bigger boxes to make be able to make bigger and they sent me dog food instead and i'm still trying to find um bigger boxes i've been on amazon looking um i might have to go to uline or to different places to try and find because i've been through a lot of my boxes i've saved downstairs that were smaller the other ones are just huge i can't i mean it would it would it, i could fill a box with 10 of those that's, that's the size of boxes i have downstairs so that's all. So I don't want to overdo make this video too long. I am trying to make under 20 minutes for this kind of stuff here. Um, so other than that, I hope you're ever, wherever you're at, you're staying safe, you're healthy, you're happy, doing what it is that makes you happy. And remember, hug, smiles, and happiness. Pass it on. Make the world a better place each and every day. Be the light in somebody's dark day. Thank you once again for spending some time with me and listening to me ramble um, and help me stash um so email me hooking and stitching dot island style at gmail.com it'll be in the description box below i know my last video i've got to go put some more i've got to add links in my my video i just remembered that um so i hope you have a great day i have to run to the mainland real quick and i still have one more video to do if i can't get it done today i gotta to do it tomorrow and that's the tutorial that takes a little bit more time i love you all thank you so much i so much appreciate you you have no idea. I'm trying to get better content. You know, I don't upload those type of content. I'm just not going to throw a video up there just for the sake of putting content up. It's got to have some kind of substance to it. Okay? Anyways, have a great day. I'll see you in the next video.